Whenever someone is admitted to a hospital in Queensland, their personal details and medical information are recorded and kept by the hospital. This patient medical record is an important record of the medical care they receive while in the hospital. Historically, hospitals have recorded and kept patient medical information in a paper chart. These charts use a lot of paper, have to be stored in a big warehouse and sometimes it can be difficult for a doctor or a nurse to find a patient's chart in a hurry. And because the information in the charts is handwritten, it might not always be easy to read. In a digital hospital, patient medical information is typed straight into a computer and stored electronically in a secure computer system. Each patient has a computer file called an electronic medical record or EMR. A patient's electronic medical record includes their medical history, details of their medical treatment, results of a patient's medical test for things like blood tests, x-rays and scans, details of medications which are prescribed for and administered to our patients, and details of any allergies or special information such as being at risk of falling, which our medical staff need to know about when caring for that patient. The digital hospital computer system also helps our medical team to see if our patients are eligible to take part in a research study or a clinical trial. If a patient is already part of a research study, then this information is included in their electronic medical record. Doctors and nurses can use any computer in the hospital to log on and look up a patient's EMR whenever they need to check on that patient. A digital hospital looks like a normal hospital, except there are lots of special computers and equipment and no paper charts. Our doctors and nurses use these devices to collect medical information about our patients. The information is automatically uploaded to a patient's electronic medical record. And if the information from the devices indicates that a patient's condition might be getting worse, our computer system will alert our doctors and nurses so they can immediately check on that patient. Even our patient's wristbands have a special barcode. Our doctors and nurses will scan a patient's wristband to confirm their identity when they're caring for a patient. The barcodes are also used to identify a patient's blood test samples and when a patient is receiving medications. Although the computers and the equipment might look complicated, our staff members in a digital hospital receive special training. Most importantly, we know that the digital hospital system helps us care for our patients safely. Having instant access to up-to-date medical information helps our doctors and nurses to make decisions about caring for their patients. The special barcode for patients and medications is proven to reduce the number of errors made when patients receive medication in a hospital. And the longer our hospitals use the digital hospital system, the more information we can collect and analyze, leading to a better understanding of how best to care for our patients. Mm -hmm.